a tablet. Uh, uh, Juno, would you mind sitting down, please? I must say, I loved your toilet roll in the toilet. It's very swanky. Thank you. You oh. didn't get that in Tesco, did you? So no, you I got sure? that in Asta. Oh. I didn't think you'd shop in Asta. Mm. Well, dear, do you always cook pancakes or? Mm. Well, I have. I would have them for breakfast in the morning. Yes, oh, really? I would too. And so would the kids. What does your boyfriend do, Mia? Or uh, he, he works as a. Oh, I don't really know. He mm. never tells me. Oh, maybe he doesn't work at all, does he? Uh, well, I don't know. Right. Now says he's going out of work, but I don't know where he's going. Oh, how long have you known him? Uh, about a year. Mm. My husband actually uh, works at Tesco. Does he? On the checkouts? Yeah. Or is he a manager? On the checkouts. Oh, very good. Oh well, I hope I get another movie soon. You know, my acting days are kind of been a bit sparse lately. The work hasn't been very forthcoming, but uh, there is a new movie coming out shortly called uh, Spartacus, and they're looking for me to do the main role. Um, have you seen the original? Um, yes, I yes, have. So I have. Mm. No more wine for you, Juno. Come on, please. Got to get Hey, thank you for a wonderful evening. Yes, Eliza. it was wonderful. Yeah. Thank you. We really enjoyed it. Yes. And let's hope we'll, uh, this is the start of a, a good week. I mean, yeah. the rest of the dinners goes as well as it. Yes. I'm talking now, okay? I'm going to yes. I'm going to give Willa a six. Well, the main course and the dessert wasn't so good. The starter, the starter was excellent, but the chicken wasn't served out very good. And the dessert, um, I just really like the pancakes, so I, that's why I'm giving her a six. All right, thank you, Mia. Bye. Yes. Um, it was a terribly enjoyable evening, apart from one of the guests got slightly inebriated and a bit drunk. And but I have to say the host handled it well. She didn't let things get out of hand. The starter was delicious. Main course, I wouldn't have brought the whole chicken out to the table myself and cut it up in front of everyone. The blood started to go a bit. Started to turn my stomach a bit queasy. So for that reason, tonight I'll give Eliza an eight for a lovely, enjoyable evening. Hi. Very fond of the wine, dude, aren't you? <laughs> How do you get the grapes to grow? Um, I get them. Uh, do you have them for I have them in another country. I get raisins, put them by a hot tree so they get jaded, and then they pop up into raisins, and then squeeze them and make the wine. Hmm. Raisins grow well, well, yes. <laughs> and do you keep any animals besides uh, growing uh, your own vegetables? Well, I have one dog and... Any chickens? Uh, yes, I have a few chickens. Oh, are they good layers? Well, they give me... Well... I get 150 eggs a year. From each of them? No, well, that's quite a good return, isn't it? What do you think, Eliza? Yeah. I suppose you don't have room for chickens in your flat. Me <laughs> mm, neither. In fact, I'd be away too much with my movies to uh, mm. look after the chickens, really, you know? Although, I have to say, that was beautiful oh, stuff, yes. Margaret. Yes, Thank you very, very much. Nice. Now, next me, okay? Um, we have to have our main course. Mia, can I just skip me to make my fish go? That's course? Margaret. Margaret. Um, Margaret, can I just skip Maine to make my fish pie? You, you have, no, the, you no, have no, the whole no. tomorrow. You're, you're not home until tomorrow. No, in the cage. In the, you know, you're reading your pie. Thanks. Yeah. But it has to be a little warm temperature. What temperature does your fish pie go at? Um, what do you mean? Which is oh. 699 grams. You know Margaret doesn't eat this, don't you? Tonight, I just have to say, surpassed all my expectations. Was the food after? was delicious, the hosting was out of this Why? world. Why A row broke out and she just, she handled it superbly. And in fact, I think Margaret is quite a dish and quite taken to her. For that reason, I'm going to give Margaret a nine. Margaret was a very good host, but the food, when I first read it on the menu, didn't sound so exciting. The only thing I really liked was the was the um, the berries in the ice cream and the also the uh, 
as a fish. I thought it was nice, but it was good, but she didn't do really any entertainment. And uh, for Juno, she's a bit drunk and she spilled four glasses of wine over me. Now I, I got really angry with that and I accidentally lost my temper. And the for the starter, for that reason, I'm going to give Margaret a seven. Okay. I loved me as the result was extra, really, really nice. So I give her a eight. Thank you. Once again, I have to say I enjoyed my evening been the only male surrounded by three beautiful females so I have to say it's not all bad. Juno tonight made a big effort she slid off the wine I have to say only a couple of stumbles here and there and the food was actually quite passable so the only thing I don't like themed team dinners and pajama parties not really my thing so for that reason I'm going to give her an eight I'll sit down. an eight. Um, Juno's was very good I liked it the starter was very very nice and again we had like a fish for like all three and I thought it was really good but not as so good. She's a bit clumsy, she dropped a light on me this time and spilt another drink on me and the light almost gave me a heart attack and she fell over and well you just can't have to call her clumsy. And for that reason, I'm going to give her a six. Thank you. Oh, I'll turn it off. I'm not ready. Okay, it's fine. Just we'll edit that as well. Just. You know, dinner wasn't that great, so I'm going to have to give her a three. That bad? Why that bad? Well. She was drunk and she was swinging all over the place, spilling wine on people, and it was my brand new dress and it got ruined, so I had to go for a tree. Okay, thank you. Margaret, yeah? You're not going to go back to him, are you? He's such a cat. <laughs> Yeah, you're young, you're beautiful. There'll be plenty of men out there. You know? Just wait. Are you okay? Yes, yeah. <laughs> girls, I hope you like the food tonight. Yes, yeah, it's delicious. Maybe I should call a taxi for you, girls. Taxi! Right. Come on, give your score. I'm going to give Niall a tag. Well, his food was delicious. He had great entertainment, and I just thought it was excellent, so I'm giving him a 10. And um, I thought Niles, it wasn't actually that great. For his starter, he had... Go away, you're not peeking by the door. For his starter, he had imaginary food. No plate, no spoon. So that was very bad. And the main course all we had was lettuce. And the... How could you, Eliza? How could you? You said it was beautiful. Out! The time. Out! This you is died. private and confidential. Uh, eh. I actually want to change my score because of that. Okay, thank you. Okay, guys. Woo! Money, money, money. I'm all that wrong. Sorry. Hold on. Results have come down with me. You start from the last. In fourth place, on the score of 17, is Juno. In third place, with a score of 18 points, is me. <laughs> In second place, with a score of 21 points, it's Willa! And that was the first... No. Yeah! Well done. well done, Margaret. 
Congratulations, Mia. What are you going to spend your money on? Her a tail to daddy. You're going to give it all to daddy. <laughs> We're going to get married, me and Marlon. 